How's it going guys? Cracked Rack here, and today I have another irresponsible story for you all from yours truly. See, when I said that I've been fired from eight different jobs in my life, I'm not lying or exaggerating. I've had a rough last decade if I'm being quite honest. And today's video in particular is about the time that I got fired from Subway. Now I'm sure a lot of you don't eat Subway because it's notoriously kind of a gross restaurant and all of their food tastes exactly the same. But I worked there for about three months and those three months were miserable. I'm working at this small town Subway and there's really only four people working there. There was the boss who was this really creepy old divorced guy. Then the other three dudes were just redneck dumb shits in their late teens that didn't really care about anything. Those guys were like 17 and I'm pretty sure they all had children to give you an idea. And working here was even worse than the other place. Because here, there weren't any hot chicks or any cool personalities or anything. It was just really old, angry Republicans who all wanted the exact same type of roast beef sandwich. Now, how I got fired from this place is a bit anticlimactic. See, the owner would give me, at 16, a bunch of cigarettes to smoke in the back because he always had, like, a whole bunch of them. And when he gave me my break, instead of taking, like, 15 minutes, which I was supposed to do, I'd take, like, 45 minute smoke breaks, where I'd smoke, like, five cigarettes at a time and play on my phone. I had given up on my job at this point and didn't really care about the consequences. I was also late to work by like 10 minutes every single day without fail. I don't think I was ever on time to work once. So eventually one day I was serving this really old lady a sandwich and she was going on a rant about how responsible I was for having a job at that age. And pretty much right when she was telling me this, my boss called me into his office and loudly fired me, like screaming at me. And I had to do the walk of shame out of that subway without my uniform on in front of that lady whose sandwich I was still in the process of making. So yeah, that's my story of how I got fired from Sub.